What's up? It's Austin. And Felicia. And welcome back to our channel. And we and know it's been a while. Sorry. <laughs> you just like just jumped right on in there. I'm telling you. I know. I'm sorry. Sorry it's been a while. Yes. It's been a little bit. Yeah. It's been a hot minute for we sure. We had adult things we were doing and stuff. Yes. But we're back now and we're going to be trying a new place so you can kind of see it behind us. Yep. So it's called Freddy's. So where is it in Pennsylvania at all or is it just... I don't think so. I think it's just in ohio maybe it's like an ohio I'm thing i'm not sure i don't know we're in ohio right now yeah but so that's kind of why we're trying it now we were kind of driving by we're like oh we've never eaten yeah there. we were taking a so, little day trip to ohio today so yes uh just you know for fun and chills so we're gonna eat freddy's and we're gonna start their fries because their fries are super tiny they are they're like, very look how thin they, they are i don't know what the deal with that is but anyway we're gonna try one plain first They remind me of uh, Rowley's they're like, fries. They're like shoestring fries. And then we got fry sauce. They have two different ones. They have a jalapeno and a regular. Um, and I guess it's pretty popular here. Yeah, I've never heard of fry sauce I before. I have either. I've um, never heard of that, so I don't know. But So we're going to try the regular first and then the jalapeno. So this is just regular fry sauce? This one's the regular. That's what it looks like. It's like a, looks like a, uh, maybe a mustard. Uh, <laughs> sorry if that cut off for you, <laughs> but it looks like either like a mustard or something. I don't know. I think the glare mm -hmm. is getting it, but. I mean, it's not bad. I don't know how I feel about the flavor. Let's try the jalapeno one. I think I like the jalapeno more. Yeah, you definitely get the jalapeno flavor. It does have a little spice to it, though. It does. I think I like the jalapeno more because the regular fry sauce tastes more like mayo than anything. That's what I was getting. Yeah, I mean, let me try a little bit more of that regular. Here, let me see. Let me get in it on that action there. See, it tastes a bit more like just plain mayonnaise with a little bit of ketchup. Yeah, that's almost what it does taste like. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not really sure what to think about the, uh, the regular fry sauce, but um, the jalapeno one's good. The though. jalapeno one is good. It does have that jalapeno flavor, and it does have you know a little bit of the, uh, the kick afterwards mm -hmm. as well. So, which is what you want, you know. It does. Yeah, I would agree with you there. But yeah, so that's their fries pretty much. And we got three other sauces in here. We got their ranch, we got their honey mustard, and their barbecue because you know, you gotta try the sauces and everything. Oh, so I shouldn't have put my fries down is what you're saying. Okay. <laughs> yes, that's what I'm saying. I'm gonna do the honey mustard first. It's kind of got that thick Dijon mustard kind of look to it. You have to get at least like two fries because like they're such tiny fries, like super thin. Yeah, it tastes like Dijon so this mustard. Is honey mustard. Yeah, but it tastes like Dijon mustard, exactly like Dijon mustard. Are you sure this is honey mustard? Mm-hmm. Hmm. Because mm. that's literally what it tastes like. It just tastes like Dijon mm -hmm. mustard. Doesn't it? Doesn't, I'm not really getting too much honey with that. That's why I was asking. It's Oats brand is what it is. Then we got Bullseye Barbecue. Another couple fries out here. I'm telling you, you have to at least do multiple fries because if you don't... Looks like regular barbecue. You're not going to get any sauce on it. Okay. Now that's pretty decent. Mm. That's a good flavor of barbecue. It's not. Too yeah, it's like a really, it's like a smoky barbecue. Yeah, almost. it yeah. is. I would agree. That's what I was looking for. Yeah, that's a pretty good barbecue, honestly. Pretty good barbecue sauce. So I do. That's probably my favorite so far is a barbecue. And then sauce. we have oats, ranch. Uh oh. Uh, oh my gosh. 
Eh, it's fine. Just gum in my hand. It's fine. I think there's uh, napkins somewhere. It's a pretty con good consistency for ranch. It's pretty good. It's not a bad flavor at all. Yeah. It's like a light ranch. It's not like mm -hmm. a really like a uh, heavy ranch. So, but yeah, that's pretty good. My favorite out of all those would probably be the barbecue, barbecue. though. The barbecue was pretty good. So yeah, the barbecue was really good. The first original like fry sauce though, I I don't know mm -hmm. what to think about that. No. I would it's do okay, the jalapeno but... if if you really like mayo, then go with the original. But if you're not a fan of mayo, go with the jalapeno. Yes, because that one tastes amazing. But now we're going to get into the main attraction here. I can't wait to bite into this. So we have the burger. Yes. So this is going to be their uh, bacon, I think bacon cheeseburger or something or other. I forget it's, what you got. Yeah, it's like the double burger or something. So it has bacon on it. It has like, um, it has onions, you know, also pickle. pickle. Mayo cheese. Mayo. It's like a steak burger, actually. Sorry. It's not really a cheeseburger. It's isn't more that of a steak, steak burger. burger? Yeah. Because Freddy's so, a steak. Yeah, I'll show you what it looks like here. So that's what it looks that like. Looks look so at good. that. Oh, look at all that yeah, close delicious up on that. toppings. Dude, I mean, come on. All right, let's bite into this here and see what's going on. And I'll take my bite now. Oh, yeah, I can't wait. Mm. This looks delicious. That's really good. Yeah, mm. you definitely get that like nice uh, smoky flavor from the steak burger. And then also you have, you know, the nice uh, just regular bun on it. But I mean, hey, you really can't go wrong. It has the bacon on it. It has a steak burger on I it. I like how thin the slices are so you can get like the full yeah. taste. And it's not overly greasy or anything no, like that. No, it's really so. not. Yeah, this is a win right here. These, they're burgers, they're steak burgers. I'm telling you, they're pretty good. So. Yeah, that was really good. And you gotta love too when they have it hanging off the side, like right there, you know. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so yeah, that's that's pretty good, honestly. For so the drinks, thumbs up from me for that. We just drinks. They have regular drinks. We just got Pepsi and Dr Pepper. And then for my main, oh, where do you want to do those next? We can do uh, those next. I was wanting to get into. Okay, these. we can do those next. So next up, we have some cheese curds here. So this is what their cheese curds look like here. They kind of look like a uh, street fry, or not street fried, carnival street curds, I guess you yeah. would say. I'll try one without and then one with sauce here. What can you say? They're cheese fried goodness. <laughs> Yeah, it's really hard to go wrong with cheese curds, honestly. But definitely better with the ranch. And if you're not familiar with cheese curds are, they're basically like little bits of like, uh, Fried what is this, like cheese. provolone or not provolone, like mozzarella. Moz I think these ones are provolone, but you can do like provolone, mozzarella, yeah. Colby. Really they're basically like little bits of cheese and then they fry them. That's pretty much it. That's yeah. literally it. It's, but it's, it's not really good. Hard. Yeah, they're really good. They have them at like uh, it's like fairs and stuff like that sometimes. Dairy Queen has them. Yeah, I think Dairy Queen does. Although these ones are better than Dairy Queens, I will say. Mm -hmm. Um, like they have a lot more cheese flavor to them, and they're bigger chunks. Dairy Queens are kind of like little itty bitty nuggets. Um, so you don't really get a lot of. Um, are you dipping that in honey mustard? I'm trying it. I mean, not bad. I guess. See what it tastes like in the fry sauce out of curiosity. <laughs> it works with the fry sauce. Does it? Hmm. It gives yeah. it a little bit of heat to the cheese. Yeah, pretty good cheese curds, honestly. I mean, yeah, like I said, you can't go wrong. I mean, with cheese, cheese curds, curds are cheese curds, you know, but I mean, they did do them pretty well, so they're really not bad. They're good. Yeah, I always have to get cheese curds when we're at like fairs and stuff because, like, it's one of my favorite things of all times at fairs. <laughs> and then for my main dish, 
I got some chicken tenders. I got five piece, which they're, these are pretty nice sized chicken tenders for, you know, getting five of them and everything. Now the question is, is it like nice, like juicy chicken on the inside or not? That's the real question of a good chicken tender. Okay. Oh, no. <laughs> so, yes, no, maybe. Mm -hmm. You gotta let me in on this action here. You can't just like. I gotta keep dip me it. I gotta dip it in sauce first, oh, bro. Oh my gosh. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's what it looks like there. They're good. I really like the breading. Mm. And they are really juicy. That's some good chicken tenders. You want ranch or barbecue? Barbecue, that's, obviously. That's some good chicken tenders. I really like the breading. I'm not sure what type of breading that is, but I like it. They're it, not too greasy. And like, they're really nice. They're tender, they're moist. And they're soft. That's how you want chicken tenders to be. They're, yeah. they're really good and they're, t they're soft. There's no like uh, fat or like anything else like that you gotta chew. No, it's like I the mean, tendons pretty, yeah, or whatever. Exactly, yeah. Like, it's pretty good. Let me try it with the barbecue now. Um, when it comes to pricing, pricing wasn't too bad for this place. Um, my meal was five chicken tender piece with a regular size fry and a drink. It was like $11, but the chicken tenders are pretty thick, so not bad. I think yours was nine something for your meal. Yeah, it wasn't too much. Yeah, it wasn't too much. Yeah, bad. so pricing really isn't that bad here, um, which is nice. So if you're looking for like something uh, on the cheaper side of fast food, I would say come to Freddy's. Um, yeah, but it's pretty good though. I mean, honestly, can't complain too much really. It's pretty good. I wish they mm -hmm. kind of had them around in our area, but unfortunately it seems like maybe it's just in other states. I don't know. Maybe they could have some in Pennsylvania. I'm not sure. I kind of wish we but, got onion rings too, but then that would have been too much food for both of us. I know. So. Yeah. Like we, we, you know, we're trying to go for a mukbang, but at the end of the day, we couldn't get like a ton of food. You know, it's not like we're like right down the street from where we live. We can like take it home. Yeah, and, like, if we were right it, down no the street, to do that. You know, if we were right uh, down the street, we would have probably got you know the onion rings. Yeah. Um, and we yeah. didn't want to waste food or anything, mm -hmm. so we we try not to be wasteful people. Um, yes. They also had uh, cheese fries, chili cheese fries, and I think you could do that with uh, your onion rings as well and your cheese curds. So if you yes. wanted extra cheese on your cheese curds, <laughs> um, you definitely could totally do that. Um, and they do have- uh, Ice cream, custard, stuff Ice like cream, that custard, yeah. which we may come back later in the day for the dessert, or we will go somewhere else for the dessert to end this video somewhere else yes. for dessert. But we will add dessert on in this video after. So there will be a little bit of a laps there so yeah um, for for us it might be a little longer but for you it'll just be a second so just stay, a split yeah. snap exactly youtube magic so we'll be back <laughs> in a second <laughs> and we are back like he said in a split second yes well a split second for you it's yeah. been a little bit for us but but we got our ice cream we got some ice cream now yes we came to paves creamery yes yeah, so it's a different place from uh before so we're not at yeah. What was the place called anymore? Freddy's. Freddy's, yeah. We're not at Freddy's anymore. Which they we're did at... have custard, but we found this place and wanted to try it. So. Yes. So it's called Pavs, P-A-V, apostrophe S. Oh, I guess it is called Pavs instead of Paves. Huh? Yeah, Pavs or, pa well, Paves or Pavs. I'm not sure how yeah. you say it, but it's called Pavs or Paves. I'm going to call it Pavs Creamery. So this is mine. I got strawberry shortcake. Yes. Um, And it's basically a shortcake um, cake with uh strawberries and then your flavor of ice cream you could choose whatever flavor and then cool it and then i got the peanut butter brownie sundae here so that's what that looks like so it's got you know a brownie obviously it has uh whipped cream which it's kind of uh smashed a little bit because of the top but it's fine 
and then it's got peanut butter ice cream as well as fudge on it as well so mm, it's really good and then satisfy my kids side which will take home probably if it makes it i got mm. some superman ice cream if you haven't had Superman ice cream or don't know what that is, look it up. Go try it. Absolutely delicious. So this is really good um, peanut butter ice cream for sure. Peanut butter ice cream is good. I'm trying to get to the brownie though. I don't know where the brownie is. <laughs> mm. Like buried. Kids side for sure. Delicious. Mm. Um trying to get to the brownie so I can try it, but there we go. It looks like it's, it's down like, there. Yeah, it's like buried underneath it. <laughs> there we go. Look at that. There's the brownie on there as well. Mm. Memories with that, Superman. Let me try a bite of yours here. How's the brownie? Brownie's really good, actually. They loaded you up here with like Cool Whip and sauces. Oh, yeah. And... Yeah, no, it's really good though. Mm. Yeah, the brownie, it's like a really like nice, like fudgy soft, brownie. Fudgy. Soft. Mm hmm. That's really good. I'm going to try it by my shortcake. It's really good. Although I will say one thing though is like. There's strawberry there. I don't know if it's like because of like the specific like toppings that you know mm. right the shortcake's really, really good. good yeah it's like really refreshing with the strawberries and the shortcake and the ice and cream the vanilla like, ice cream yeah. yeah it's like a refreshing dessert um i don't know if it's just because of like the type of like uh items they use for each thing but like they are some of the prices for certain things are a little a little like, pricey. Yeah. yeah. Like, I'll pop up the numbers. Well, actually, I have them here. Yeah, so the this one here for the Sunday was six seventy five, and then that one was six six dollars Six. And then for, like, one tiny scoop of ice cream, it was $4. Yeah, like so $3.95. It's so. worth it to get the Sundays instead, and then a scoop of ice cream. And also for the adults out there, they have an adult Sunday. Um, and then adult milkshakes, which basically when I say adult, it's just because there's added alcohol in them. So. Which we didn't get because we have to drive home and yeah. everything, but you know. <laughs> but yeah, that's, on the road. that's pretty much it. We thought we'd throw in a little secondary portion here, trying a different place for dessert. So, so if you like this format, let us know down in the comments if you yeah. kind of like this format and set up, you know, like we try one place and then try a different place in the same video for like a dessert or something. You know, let us know how you like it. Let us know if you've been to either of these places and if you like them. And, and what you tried. What your thoughts were on it. But we definitely and, uh, yeah. recommend both because they they were both really good. Like Freddy's, I would go back to. I'd probably come back to this if I was craving something like, you know, like this, refreshing or whatever. Yeah. But, yeah. But yeah. Otherwise, both places were honestly really good. So, I was really surprised. I mean, yeah. it was a really uh, good video overall. So It was. <laughs> But uh, yeah, anyway, guys, thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe if you enjoyed. And uh, yeah, we'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys. Bye, guys.